I have a quick tip for you today. I want to show you how you can highlight the active row in Microsoft Excel. So look at this example. As I click on any row, that gets highlighted. So this makes it super easy for me to follow across on that row, and it's super easy to do. Here's the demo data that I'm going to use here today. If you want to follow along with me, I'll put a link to this uh, worksheet down below in the description and you can download it and follow along with me. This is a three step process. The first step is very quick. We just need to select everything. I'm going to use control A, the shortcut to select everything on this sheet. Now the next step is to go to conditional formatting. So if I go under the home, and I'm going to conditional formatting right here, drop down and go ahead and pick new rule. When this opens up, we need to pick the last one on the list right here, use the formula to determine which cells to format. So select this, and this is where that formula is gonna go. So the formula we're gonna use is this one, equals row, open bracket, close bracket, equals cell, open bracket, quotation mark, row, quotation mark, and bracket. So now this is down below in the description as well. So you can just highlight, copy, and paste it right into here to save yourself some time. I'm gonna hit uh, format. We need to select the color, which we want to have uh, highlighted in. So in this case, I'm just gonna go and pick this green here and hit okay. Or I'm gonna hit okay one more time. So now notice nothing seems to be changing as I click on it. If I double click here, it, it does do some things. So, so it's sort of doing it right, but I need to add one more step here. So what we need to do is change the code a little bit, but the, don't worry, this is super easy too. If I go to the bottom on the sheet here, right click, I'm gonna go to view code. And we need to make sure we're under worksheet here. So if you drop down, if you're under general, you're not gonna see anything. Uh, what we want is the worksheet here. So I'm gonna go ahead and just type this. You're gonna type target.calculate, just like this. And once you have that in, you can close out. We can close out of this as well. Now notice, as I click on each one, we have that row highlighted. So in a couple of minutes, you can have this all done. If you're working on that sheet over and over again, this can just save a lot of hassle visually when looking across those rows.